More forged documents have emerged in connection to a woman at the centre of a New Hub investigation. Nicola Flint claims she was dying from cancer and it's understood she's under police investigation for allegedly ripping off the Christchurch Football Club. Now, close family members have told us about other stories she told them, that she's the daughter of an earl who was 13th in line to the throne and she was once crowned European Banker of the Year. Juliet Speedy has this exclusive report. <laughs> This is Nicola Flint arriving at a 40th party several weeks ago in the UK. Flint claims she's had terminal cancer since at least 2016. She's told those close to her she is currently undergoing aggressive cancer treatment that's far better than she could get in New Zealand. The gruelling treatment hasn't stopped her dancing the Macarena. Since News Hub broke the story of Nicola Flint's alleged six-figure fraud at Christchurch Football Club, as well as unearthing fraudulent medical documents that claim she was dying, several people close to Flint and her husband have reached out to News Hub. News Hub has obtained a second apparently fraudulent letter on breast care letterhead with the faked signature of a respected Christchurch surgeon. The 2017 letter with spelling mistakes and grammatical errors says the tumours had metastasized into the spinal and neck areas of the bones resulting in stage 4A or advanced breast cancer being diagnosed. Intensive radiation has led to relatively high levels of internal bleeding due to the weakening and prolapse of the colon. In some cases we have seen survival over two years but less than three years. That was seven years ago. A friend and colleague from ANZ told News Hub she always questioned her terminal cancer. UK-born Nicola Curry met Kiwi husband Andrew Flint in Bermuda, where she has told people she had worked at HSBC Bank, but that she'd also been a heroin addict. The pair were married in 2010 and now have two children. News Hub has no evidence to suggest that Andrew Flint knew of the alleged fraud. We have spoken to numerous sources close to Nicola Flint and heard the stories she has told them, including multiple cancers and ailments. Did you ever believe what she told you? Other stories close family said she told them include She was the daughter of an earl who was 13th in line to the British throne, but she was written out of the will. Her ex-husband bought a yacht and got lost at sea presumed dead. She won half a million dollars working for HSBC after being awarded European Banker of the Year, but lost the money paying for her mother's court case after she allegedly ran over a pedestrian and murdered her husband with a pillow. The Flint St Albans home now sits empty after the family abruptly left the country in December. Neither Nicola Flint nor her husband have responded to repeated requests for comment. They both remain in the UK while police here continue to investigate. Julia Speedy, News Hub.